Hi friends, I am Avira Sabankar. So today's topic is Havoc OS 2.0 on MI Heaven. So let's see the about phone. As you can see, it's Havoc OS latest version. It has 5th December security patch. It comes inbuilt with 4.9 kernel, that is mount kernel. I have installed a custom kernel that is a canting kernel. So it comes inbuilt with pixel launcher, which doesn't have much customizations. See, that's it. So the main customizations are in Havoc settings. So settings and Havoc settings. Here you get tons of customizations. See in status bar, you get double tap to sleep, brightness control, quick pull down, smart pull down, clock settings, breathing SMS, battery style, battery percentage, battery bar, network traffic, many customizations. In quick settings, you get option of customize rows and columns in quick settings over here. Then you can Customize the elements that is brightness icon. See, and an interface you get a UI style, background color, notification background color, ascent color, night mode, OS header style, OS style style, and display. You get a font manager, font size, display size, and etc. Also get the rounded corner radius and rounded corner padding and dashboard icons. Then in ambient display you get the option of and ambient display like always on etc. Then in screen you can get the option of smart pixels and enable screen stabilizer. Then in buttons you can customize volume bu volume rockers, power menu and the hardware buttons. Then in navigation bar you can customize the navigation and in gestures you get system gestures that is swipe fingerprint for notification and swipe fingerprint left or right for display notification then jump to camera and prevent ringing then three finger screenshot swipe gestures and swipe up gestures then in lock screen you get double tap to sleep media cover art Enable lock screen visualizer. You get many options in lock screen also. Then in recents, you can choose the recent style of quick step that is the inbuilt Android Pie recents in stock and Android Go. Then in notifications, you get a notification charging light, blink flashlight for call, etc. Then in animations, you can customize the animation for activity, open, close, etc. Then in system, you get signature spoofing, CPU info, burn in protection, and IMEI settings, and battery saving settings, and miscellaneous. You get many options in this. So the battery life of this room is pretty great. I got 7 hours of screen on time. See, as you can see, 7 hours, 2 minutes of screen on time. So let's see the things which don't work. I have written it in the notes. See, screen flickering is the one issue. As it is based on the 4.9 kernel, so the screen flickers. See, I'll show you again. It's based on 4.9 kernel. So. When you open YouTube or suppose when you open Chrome, see, you can see the search bar. See, I'll show you again. It flickers. Then next, long press notification don't work. See, long press notification. See, the system UI restarts. As you can see. I'll show you again. See, system UI restarts. 
नेक्स्ट इज स्वाइप फिंगरप्रिंट फॉर डिस्प्ले नोटिफिकेशन डोंट वर्क सी स्वाइप फिंगरप्रिंट नोटिफिकेशन वर्क बट सी इट डोंट वर्क लेफ्ट और राइट फॉर डिस्प्ले नोटिफिकेशन इट डोंट वर्क नेक्स्ट इज यू कैन चेंज वॉल पेपर सी इन डिफॉल्ट लॉन्चर वेन यू टैप ऑन वॉल पेपर अथिंग हैपन्स सी Sometimes nothing happens and sometimes black screen appears. See, nothing happens. Next is home home button long press Google Assistant don't work. See, I'm long pressing Google Assistant. See, it don't work. I've enabled the option in the settings. See, I'll show you buttons. See, long press home button, Google Assistant, but it don't work. So these were the things which don't work in Havoc OS. So what do you think? How was the video? Tell us in the comment section. If you like the video, smash the like button and subscribe channel for more awesome content like this. So we'll be till next video. Thank you.